So in this example, I'm going to show you how to calculate the or to find the mean from a grouped frequency table. So what we've been told is that there are two people who've run, let's say, 100 meters um, between 10 and 12 seconds. Now this is a little mistake here, so we'll just cross that out. Okay, so up to 12 seconds, but not including 12. So two between 10 and 12 seconds, six from 12 up to 14 seconds, four between 14 and 16 seconds and one person between 16 and 18 seconds. Now to calculate um, the mean, we're going to have to make an estimate for the times in each interval. And the estimate we take is the midpoint, um, called the midpoint x. Now the midpoint of 10 and 12 can be found by doing 10 plus 12 divided by 2. We'll see that that comes to 11. Now, you might have realised that 11 also was halfway between 10 and 12. So our next midpoint will be 13. The next midpoint will be 15. And the next midpoint will be 17. Now if these intervals were larger numbers, simply use your calculator. So the method is to add the first and the last together and to divide by 2. Now our problem is really like previous frequency tables. We need um, to calculate how many people um, the total time taken by the two people that ran between 10 and 12 seconds. So we simply do the FX again. 2 11s are 22. 6 13s, or 6 10s are 60, and 6 3s are 18, so that's 78. 4 15s are 60, and 1 17 is 17. Now, in most cases, you'll find this question on the calculator paper but occasionally uh, it's not. Now this one we could do most of it without a calculator. We've got 22 and 78 is 100, 160 and 17. Our total is 117. Now if we go to our frequencies, we've got 2 and 6 is 8, 8 and 4 is 12, so we have 13. So we have 13 runners, 2 of which ran between 10 and 12, 6 between 12 and 14, 4 between 14 and 16, one between 16 and 18. We take the midpoint as the estimate of the times. We multiply f by x to get our fx column. So our, our mean, the mean is what we're trying to work out from the group frequency table, is the sum of the fx column, as it was uh, before, if you've seen the previous video on ungrouped, and it will be 117 divided by 13. So we'll now do 13 into 117. 13 doesn't go into 1, 13 doesn't go into 11, um, but 13 tens, 13 times 10, would be 130. So if we take 13 off 130, we get 117. So 13 will go into 117 exactly nine, um, nine times. Now that indicates to me that there's something um, wrong because no, it doesn't, sorry. sorry. Um, let's just get this right. Uh, it's the 13, 117 divided by 13, yeah. So 9 seconds doesn't seem right because none of the times were between 9 seconds. So what we can see is if we look back, um, alright, so I want you to see what I've done there. I've done 13 into 117 and said the answer is 9. Now that answer cannot be right because the lowest time was 10 seconds. So if I look at uh, my adding up again, and this often happens, you can make one small error, even though the method was right, and it was, was in my adding up, it was 160, 177. So I carried through the wrong answer at that point there, 177. I picked the, uh, the mistake up by seeing that the answer I got was an impossibility. The, the mean will be somewhere in the middle of the data, and the data was between 10 seconds and 18 seconds. So now I've corrected it, I've got to do 100, uh, I've got to do 13 into 177. So 13 get, doesn't go into 1, it goes into 17 once with a 4 over. So 13 into 47, well, 13 threes are 39, so it goes in 13 times with remainder 6, 13 remainder 6. So my answer then is 13 and 6 thirteenths um, of a second. Now if we did that with a calculator, okay so we'll just quickly do that with a calculator. So cancel what I previously done. 
So one minus seven divided by thirteen. Go back. One one seven divided by thirteen. Not quite right, is it? One oh yeah, I'm doing the same thing again. Right, one seventy seven, I need to say one seven seven divided by thirteen. Make sure we're there, thirteen point six. One decimal place. So that is the mean from a Greek frequency table showing you how to check um, if your answer is right and to make a correction when it was incorrect.